of the goals of the, of the presidency was to... Much more, but for me the most important priority, our most significant... I think that today the health ministers managed to look forward in a straight way rather than taking considerations other than those relating to health into consideration. They took the life and the health of their citizens in prime consideration, which does not mean that we should not be sensitive to other interests, but that the primary interest remains that of protecting health. Any questions? Today was an important step towards ensuring that people know what tobacco products contain, know the damage they can do, and will help make sure that our children and our future generations will make knowledgeable, informed choices. And I do believe that this is a truly important step because it's about stopping the next generation ever getting hooked. And it's another example of how efficient systems can provide better care at better value. That's advertisement. That's entrapment of our young people. That's a warning. And that's clear. That's what it does to you. And I think if you haven't started, and we all know how difficult it is to give up, the message has to be, don't take it up, because you have no idea how long it'll take you to take, put it down again. It can never be, never a choice between. Each year, as you now and well know, 700,000 people across the EU die from tobacco-related illnesses. So many thousands more suffer with chronic illnesses brought on by tobacco consumption. Smoking is one of the greatest preventable, avoidable threats to people's health. The economic and societal cost of this, the burden on our healthcare systems, the cost to welfare systems, the Commission estimates this at 25 billion a year. At, uh, at the common stand now here from the Member States and at your proposal, could you 